In my mind, I see a line. And over that line, I see green fields and lovely flowers and beautiful white women with their arms stretched out to me over that line. But I can't seem to get there, no how. I can't seem to get over that line. That was Harriet Tubman in the 1800s. Hidden Figures. And I read the script, and I just remember thinking, how come I've never heard this story before? And I started asking you, have you ever heard of these women? Have you ever heard of Katherine Johnson? Did you know women had anything to do with the great space to ra um, race to space? And the answer kept coming up, no. And I was like, angry. Because this is a very important piece of history that we should know. I did not know that that was a dream that I could have. Yeah, I can act like I know math, but I'm not mathematically wired. I'm a strong black woman, and I cannot be intimidated, I cannot be undermined, I cannot be thought uh, to be afraid of. Nigerian women have proven their grit in the area of business and governance. Nigeria is home to female entrepreneurs such as Forlorn Shaw Alakija, who, according to Forbes, is one of the richest women on earth with an estimated net worth of $1.7 billion dollars. The women featured today have overcome the numerous challenges faced by small and medium enterprises in Nigeria. Entrepreneur, talk show host, and now film producer. Is there anything that Mo Abadu can't do? Wow, that's a loaded question. I'm sure there are many things I can't do. I find that there are certain gaps that need to be filled. And at that right time, I get a whisper that says, Mo, it's time to do that next thing. To say to women out there everywhere, don't allow these right wing talking heads, these dishonorable people to intimidate you or scare you. Be who you are, do what you do, and let us get on with discussing the real issues of this country. amazing network of girlfriends. It's really small, but they've been riding and die with me for over 10 years. You know, I just got, you know, you get torn down and you forget who you are and you don't think you're anything <laughs> because of the, the mental abuse that you suffer so I was trying to save my life by writing songs like indestructible like I can't be destroyed so I wrote that song before I even started going through all of this mess and um, when it all blew up in my face it was nothing I could do because you know everything was just dead and 